Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining us for NBA action on 2K Sports. Along with Hall of Famer Doris Burke and Grant Hill, I'm Brian Anderson. Ali LaForce joins us from the sidelines. And here's a look at what's coming up for the Phoenix Suns. On Thursday, they'll be matching up with LeBron James and the Los Angeles Lakers. Then on Sunday, they'll be matching up with Damian Lillard and the Portland Trailblazers. What a great opportunity for this team to take a step forward. They have some tough road games coming up, and that kind of stretch can bring a team together. Winning some of these games would be huge for their overall confidence. All right, now the opening lineup for Phoenix. Manning the backcourt, it's Beal and Booker. Durant and Aiden are up front, and it's Watanabe in at the three. And for Los Angeles, Westbrook and George manning the backcourt. Leonard and Batum, the duo at forward, and it's Zubats in at the five. Pretty interesting backcourt matchup here, Grant, with a lot of star power at the guard positions on both sides. And you know, traditionally, B.A., when big guys match up, it's all about the power. <laughs> but this contest is about finesse. Who can outplay and outsmart the competition? Beal against Westbrook. And Aiden pulls it down. And so it's Aiden with it. He brings it up for the Suns. Inside. Oh, and the jam by Aiton. Aiton uses his length to his advantage. No doubt on the dunk. Westbrook taking his time here. Leonard on the wing. And it's Watanabe with a rebound. And it's Phoenix's ball. Their last encounter was in Phoenix. Last time, free throw shooting was their kryptonite. Just could not keep pace. Durant with a screen on Leonard. Watanabe passes to Durant. Outside Booker. Six on the shot clock. Right at the free throw line. Goes back up. And it's out of bounds. Still Phoenix's ball. How about Zubats work so hard on the defensive end? Nicely done. First quarter, just over a minute play. Beal finds Aiden. Just five to shoot. Aiden, a screen on Leonard. Here's Durant. Now, there's a reason this guy has won multiple Defensive Player of the Year awards. How much pressure can he guard with? My goodness. Yeah, you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. Shooting two. The first one falls. You know, Grant, what's interesting about the Clippers, they play solid defense, even though they're not overly disruptive. Well, B.A., think about this. So many veterans, they know how to position themselves. They know where the help is coming from, too. And, of course, they know when to pick their spots. fall so he hits both of them here's George coming off a 22 point game against the Lakers first minute and a half of basketball played here in this one you know over his career Paul George has racked up more than his fair share of accolades Graves. well he's a fixture at all-star weekend that's for sure now he's made the all defensive team more than a few times he's had an outstanding career and the first one at the line is good I think the experience Paul George possesses is so valuable to his team this guy is such a seasoned vet hits them both two-part equation you have to be aggressive enough to get to the line then talented enough to sink them Beal left side Watanabe passes to Booker poke loose back to Watanabe Duran with a screen on Batum here's Watanabe and the three off target just one made field goal in five tries not a good start Here's Leonard, and Aiden pulls it down. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. Durant, the pass to Watanabe. 
Durant with a screen on Leonard. Back to Durant. And Durant with the big finish. Boy, Kevin Durant near impossible to guard in the pick and roll. In that instance, the quick cut off the screen, so pretty. For Los Angeles, they've gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Pass to George. Back to Leonard. And the dunk by Leonard. There you go. He's a monster at the rim. So athletic. Obviously, he plays on the attack. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Durant, the pass to Watanabe. That's good. And so Durant with the assist. Uh, Kevin Durant sees the game as well as any player. With his size and vision, that combination is lethal. Pass to Zubats. Here's George. Booker defending. Now here's Westbrook. Leonard outside. Down low. Nice shot by George. Now, Kawhi Leonard understands when and where to deliver the ball to his teammates. Pretty play. And so Beal will bring it up for the Suns. They come into this one having outplayed the Grizzlies last time. Yeah, and that one came down to their rebound. There was a big gap between the two teams there. That was a coach's dream, to get that kind of effort and intensity on the glass and for it to pay those kinds of dividends, critical. Just under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the first quarter. And the foul called on Paul George. That'll be a second foul of the game. And that puts them just one foul from the bonus. Powell, he's checked in for George. Number 24, Norman Powell. Durant with a screen on Powell. Booker, pass to Durant. And it's slammed in by Durant. Now KD is showing a little bit of elevation. Here's Leonard. Nine points for him in his last game. Batum sets a screen. Now here's Leonard. He's covered closely. Can't cash it in from the high post. That's a shot he'd like back. He's usually going to make those. Here's Durant. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. And they're really attacking the paint with a fury. Martin, he's checked in for the Clippers. And a chance for a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for Phoenix. They've done a great job facilitating so far. So moving the rock and finding the open man, just great selfless basketball. Yeah, and their assertiveness in the paint so far tonight has been impactful. They're really making it hard for the interior defense. Powell's shot is off. Well, tremendous defensive effort on the interior. That's the kind of contest you want. Aiden passes to Watanabe. Back to Aiden. The kick to Durant. Shot clock at six. From behind the arc. Batum pulls it in. The Clippers trail. To the inside. Out of bounds. It'll be Phoenix's ball. He's really been spectacular lately. Here's your Western Conference Player of the Week, Kevin Durant. And you could not find a more deserving guy for this award. His ability to be whatever his team needs on both ends of the floor is an essential part of their success out there. Now here's Aiden. He picked up 18 points in their last win against Memphis. You know what else impressed me? How infectious his tenacity was. Simply a wrecking ball on the boards collected huge amounts of rebounds. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. Oh, you love it. Fearless, aggressive, leaving no doubt whatsoever. Aiden, the three is up. And Durant hits from deep. Durant's got 12 points in the game. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Powell in the post. Booker defending. 
Well, Grant, with that time of the year where trade rumors start to heat up and speculation on social media runs rampant. Oh, you're so right. I mean, we're not just talking players, too. A number of coaches are on the hot seat as well, so it can be a bit of a distraction for everyone. And, of course, the only cure is winning. Well, the athletic Norman Powell continues to grow as an offensive player. Boy, this guy has got huge upside on the offensive end. Gordon, he's checked in for Watanabe. And so Powell nails them both. The Suns leading. Now Durant. Turned in an outstanding game against Memphis. And Gordon with the basket on the assist by Durant. The offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. They have used their size and their strength to get off any shot they want. They've dominated on the interior. Westbrook can't hit. For Phoenix, they've got 8 of 13 attempts to go. Pass to Aiden. Deal with it. His first shot coming late. Batum pulls it in. The Clippers have gone only three for nine from the floor. And for some reason, he decided to foul there. Yeah, B.A., that's an odd move. Maybe there's something else behind it. You don't want to stop the clock right there. I'm not quite sure what he was thinking. Okogie's checked in for the Suns. The Clippers call timeout. Let's take a second to see which teams have been hitting the glass with a fury this season. The Suns, number one. And I love how active they all are on the glass. When a shot goes up, this team takes a gang rebounding approach to tracking down their boards. On defense, the Suns. Ten-point lead. Well, from broadcasting to team ownership, heading USA Basketball. Grant, what drives you to do so much these days? Well, B.A., I'm an active guy, and I had a great playing career. But the things I wasn't able to do because of the injury, I think, left me even more motivated to excel and try new things in this next chapter of my life. And finished off by Westbrook. Boy, just good heads-up play by Batum. Spots the open man, but delivers it on time and on target. Aiden, a screen on Westbrook. Booker, the pass to Aiden. And Aiden with the stuff. What a way to begin this game. Dominating at both ends of the floor. And give them credit for approaching this game with the right energy and intensity. This team has attacked every chance they've gotten. Now here's Powell. 17 points for him. Last game against the Lakers. Got it. This guy is a pick-your-poison kind of player. Very hard defensively to cover all your bases with that. Here's Durant. They're leading by eight. And there's the screen. To the paint. Here's a Kogi. That's good. And so Durant with the assist. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Powell against Gordon. Nice move. And Powell with the lay-in. Powell's got his second basket of the night. Well, this guy very capable of capitalizing close to the rim. Norman Powell making an impact inside. Booker, the pass to Okogi. Durant with it. Batum's on him. Durant with the bucket. And I'll tell you, the team is simply riding the hot hand. This guy has been lights out. Powell outside. Back to Westbrook. Zubox with a screen on Booker. Westbrook. And Aiden pulls it down. Aiden's got his fifth rebound in this one. Durant finds Booker. Durant with a screen on Westbrook. Here's Booker. Rebound by the Clippers. And that's out of bounds. It was last touched by Booker. Now a moment to take a look at the year-to-year -year scoring output and how it's been trending for Norman Powell. And when you look at his offensive output over the past few years, it seems like other teams have figured him out and have his number now. He's having to put in a lot more effort on the offensive end, but without producing nearly the same results. Now here's Batum. No made baskets yet. 
Powell outside. Clock at six. Out left to the wing. And here's Westbrook from the arc. A smart defender. Booker can anticipate and uses good balanced movement to get in position. Pass to Aiden. Aiden with a scream. Gordon, the pass to Aiden. And Aiden with the stuff. They're not wasting any time putting their stamp on this game. What a start. And they've been doing it largely at the offensive end. If the defense does not adjust, this could be a blowout. Powell with it. He's got six. Time called here. Time out, time Los out. Angeles decides to talk it over. And no doubt, Coach wants them to improve their interior defense. I think right now they're giving up way too many easy looks. That is a recipe for disaster. So for the Clippers, Plumlee's checked in for Zubats. Covington comes in for Batum. And it's Mann in for Russell Westbrook. Bowl, he's checked in for the Suns. It's Covington on the wing. Martin with the ball. Durant covering. Pass to Powell. Covington, a screen on Gordon. Here's Powell. Second shot opportunity. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It goes on Bull Bull. Man, good whistle there. At the line for two. Mason Plumley. First free throw is good. misses they're playing with a lot of energy tonight we can see that in their dominance on the glass Covington against Durant there's a screen by Bull Durant drops in and it's slammed in by Durant boy Kevin Durant puts it on the deck able to navigate and get to the cup here's man Pass to Martin. Back to man. Down to five on the shot clock. Plumley with it. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Well, use the pick and going right to the cup. I love the aggressiveness. Booker on the take. Covington grabs the board. The Clippers have gone seven of 16 so far. Here's Plumley. Outside Covington, the three. Phoenix grabs the miss. Durant's got four rebounds now. Pass to Okogi. Bowl, a screen on Powell. Here's Gordon. Can't get a second shot to fall, now one of two. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Here's Mann. Booker defending. Powell against Gordon. Ooh, a clear look for Powell. Off the mark. Had a chance there to trim it to single digits. Bull finds Durant. Here's Booker. 13 feet out. Tries again. There's a screen by Bull. From the line. Nails it. And he's one for five with that one. Well, it wasn't a pretty start for him, but now he's got a bucket to build on. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Powell's shot is off. It's been that kind of quarter for him. The shot has just been unreliable. Gordon, right side. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. It goes on Mason Plumley. At the line for the Suns, Aaron Gordon. Two shots. That free throw misses. The Suns making a switch here.
And he's good on the second. With one on the clock. He can't get that one to fall. Kevin Durant has been leading the charge for Phoenix. He had solid production this quarter with scoring and rebounding. We'll be right back with you shortly. And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but plenty of time left for a comeback. And guys, the Suns enjoying a nice lead here. Well, it's simple. When you can dominate the boards at both ends, you can control the second chance touches. And that's how they controlled the first quarter. I thought they were the much more physical team. They've got Terrence Mann. Kenyon Martin is out there with Mason Plumley. Then it's Norman Powell. And it's George in at the shooting guard position. That's the group for the Clippers starting the second. Bowl, the pass to Beal. Just five on the clock. Gordon with it. Guarded now by George. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. You will have to finish harder than that if you want to convert to traffic. Here's Martin. It's good. Set up beautifully by George. Martin's got his first two points of the night. What a slick look by Paul George. Defense expecting him to shoot, but he decides otherwise. Pull the screen on Martin. Here's Bates Diop. And no good. His first shot of the night. Missing. And it's Powell with the ball for the Clippers. Down by 12. They'll be hosting Toronto for their next one. That'll be the second of a two-game stretch at home. Here's George. Unable to get that one. Solid defense from Bowl. Beal right side. Pass to Bates Diop. Pull a screen on Martin. For three. Phoenix no good that time either. And for the Clippers, they're shooting only 36% so far in this game. The lead now cut to single digits. George has got seven points. This guy practically automatic. Paul George in the catch and shoot. Look out. Bates D off the screen. Pass to Gordon. Pulls it in from the elbow. Jump shot is good. He's got five. The Clippers have got two of three shots to go in the second. Throws it down despite a man right in his face. Opportunity here to make it a three-point play. He can really read the floor. Precision pass in rhythm. Some changes for Phoenix. Watanabe's checked in for Bates Diop. And Goodwin is subbed in for Gordon. And Grant, you talked about it early in your playing days, blaming yourself for the Pistons not winning. Talk about that pressure on the best player to deliver wins. Well, B.A., the pressure's real, and it's tough to keep perspective and just control what you can control. When you're tasked with leading a team to victory, you expect it first and foremost from yourself. The Clippers have gotten three or four field goals in the second quarter. George for three. Another miss. He's two for four. Well, the defense clearly was not interested in guarding him from downtown. They're very fortunate he missed. Watanabe can't get it to go. Boy, if you're going up against this guy in this close a range, you've got to defend with everything you've got. A tremendous job defensively. At the line for LA, Paul George. One shot. Gordon, he's checked in for the Suns. Number 23, Aaron Gordon. Los Angeles has gone one of two from deep in the second quarter. To the middle. Picked it out of midair! And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second. Here's Goodwin. Over Plumley. Sinks the 15-footer. And the Suns lead by 11. 
Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. And let's send it over to Ali LaForce. The Clippers are certainly a deep team, and Kawhi Leonard said, we have a lot of talented wings on our team that can play both ways. Dribble, shoot the ball, able to guard multiple positions. And I think that's what you need right now in the NBA. Guys that can guard, switch, and knock down open shots. Brian? Yeah, true enough. Ali, thanks. Now here's Gordon. He's got five. They swipe it. Now here's Martin. Pass to man. And almost four minutes gone in the second quarter of play. Six to shoot. George against Gordon. They get it back. Slam! Dunk by Plumley. Just great energy on the offensive glass. That's exactly how you cut into a lead. Boy, a slam like that is sure to give him a spark. Now here's Gordon. Nine points in his last outing. Rebound by the Clippers. Plumley's got his fifth rebound in this one. Here's Mann. For three, George. No luck on that one. Gordon against Powell. Gordon, the pass to Beal. The three is up. Gets his second attempt to go. Now he's one for two. Down in the corner, Beal shoots with confidence. Just one more area he can score from consistently. Here's Powell. Back to George. Tries it from 16. Connects. The jumper drops. George has got nine points now in the quarter. And he's coming off a huge performance, and his confidence couldn't be any higher. And his coach knows that, too. Well, the best players, to me, deliver night after night after night. So as long as he's hot, keep riding it. I'll tell you what. It's good to be his age. Yeah. I don't have memories like that at my age, though. <laughs> and a new group getting ready for the Clippers. Zubats. He's checked in for Plumley. Batum comes in for Martin. Kawhi Leonard's checked in for Powell. And it's Westbrook in for Mann. Durant, he's checked in for the Suns. Devin Booker comes in for Goodwin. Now here's Westbrook. 11 points for him last game against the Lakers in Los Angeles. And let's not forget about the assist. This guy is a playmaker, was a driving force for that offense. If I'm a young fan watching the NBA, Kawhi Leonard is a guy I'm keeping a close eye on, Graham. He does everything the right way. B.A., so much to like about Kawhi's game and how he carries himself. He takes so much pride in what he does on both ends of the floor. Here's Leonard. They look to him to score consistently, averaging around 13 and a half a game. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Now just a five-point Suns lead. And their shots are dropping with more consistency now. Pass to Beal. Now here's Durant. Outside Booker. Screen by Durant. The three ball. What a throwdown from KD. I love the urgency KD plays with. This guy works hard to convert every time. Westbrook, the pass to Zubat. Back to Westbrook. George outside. Batum sets a screen. No good from outside. And they just continue to dominate the boards. Durant, the pass to Watanabe. Screen by Durant. And it's slammed in by Durant. With Kevin Durant just lighting up the stat sheet right now. He's in a rhythm, and that's trouble. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for the L.A. Clippers. Nine-point game. Leonard, left side. Steps back and fires. And that one comes off the assist by Westbrook. Leonard's got four points this quarter. Well, it doesn't get much easier than that. Even a decent shooter is going to make that with no pressure. 
Oh, a screen on George. Booker, the pass to Beal. To the inside. Zubats with the steal. And it's the Clippers on the break. Yep, count it. How about since he entered the league, Kawhi Leonard has tripled his assist average. What a good passer he has become. Booker against George. Durant, pass to Bowl. Durant with a screen on two bucks. Back to Durant. Shot clock at six. Bowl, a screen on Batum. Badanami passes to Bowl. And it's going to be a 24 second violation. They turn it over. Boy, not sure what happened on that one. Just an unforced error. And the Clippers making a change here. Powell's checked in. Gordon, he's checked in for the Suns. Goodwin comes in for Bradley Beal. And here's Westbrook. He has six. Pass to Zubats. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. Setting each other up beautifully. I love it. Eight of their last ten points coming off assist. Durant surveying the D. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It's going to be on even to Zubats. <laughs> no debate there. He, he got hammered. That free throw, no good. Eubanks, he's checked in for Gordon. up missing both free throws. Los Angeles has gone 2 of 5 from distance here in the second quarter. Westbrook, the pass to Leonard. A little mid-range shot is up. It's rebounded by Goodwin. The Suns have gotten 7 shots out of 14 attempts in the second quarter. Pass to Eubanks. Here's Goodwin. Leonard defending. Goodwin passes to Booker. Down low. Here's Watanabe. And down it goes. Dunked it through off a beautiful setup. So courageous. Taking it right to the defender. Oh, this dude knows how to finish in traffic. Wow. Now here's Westbrook. He's got six. It's Powell. High post. Leonard against Durant. Batum sets a screen. And here's Westbrook from the arc. On target from range. Westbrook's got five points now in the quarter. Boy, it took him a while to warm up, but since the second quarter, he's on fire. Outside Durant to the paint. Here's Watanabe. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. A tough loss coming against the Lakers in their last game play. Yeah, it was really just the failure to convert shots on a consistent basis. <laughs> That's going to cost you games, believe me. I thought most of the shots they took were low percentage looks. The key in the NBA is, can you get your best scorers into their best spots? They didn't do that. Here's Goodwin. Eubanks the screen. Goodwin passes to Watanabe. Knocks down the triple. Watanabe's got 11. You like how their perimeter game is building out. They're feeling it right now. Here's Westbrook. And it's Watanabe with a rebound. Phoenix has gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. Durant, the pass to Watanabe. Durant with a screen on Zubats. Pass to Booker. Shoots over Powell. Booker no good. Los Angeles has gone four of seven from three during the second quarter. That's too easy for Leonard. I'll tell you, you can't put your head down after a tough first quarter. You've got to keep fighting, and now he's starting to roll. Phoenix has gone two of four from the perimeter in the second so far. Watanabe sets a screen. Goodwin passes to Booker. 46 seconds left to play in the first half. Six on the shot clock. 
Kept alive. The kick to Durant. Pass to Watanabe. Here's Goodwin. Outside Booker. Shoots over Zubac. He hits it just before the shot clock expires. Booker's got his second basket. Westbrook outside. Pass to Leonard. With the 10-footer. That one's wide left. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Suns ahead, up two. Well, now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce. Allie. Thanks a lot. I'm with Okay, Allie, appreciate it. And folks, we'll be back after halftime to begin the third quarter. Welcome, folks, for the Phoenix Suns tonight. They're looking at what should be a good battle in a game that's still up for grabs. Well, they got the extra credit for their hustle on the glass. Playing with great energy and intensity, they came into this game determined not to be outworked. And what I like, it's pretty much every possession. They just don't take many plays off. And let's switch gears for a second, checking out social media. You both played on each side of the country. So, Kenny, ballers all day. That does it for halftime. Let's get back to game action. Here's Brian Anderson with the start of the third quarter. Just joining us, we played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. You know, Kevin Durant has really been making it happen here, guys. He's been a real difference maker today in terms of reeling in offensive boards. Really putting his handprint on this game. You love the hustle, you love the work ethic he has had on display. On the court right now for the Suns. The deadly duo of Beal and Bucker at the one and the two. Two great players inside. They have KD and Aiden. And it's Watanabe in at the small forward position. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for the Clippers. Trailing by four. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Well, over time, Russell Westbrook has worked on perfecting that up fake. He takes pride in getting the defenders off their feet. First one falls for him. He makes one or two that time. Perhaps the thing I will remember most when Russell Westbrook decides his career is done is how he brought competitive fire and spirit every single night, guys. Durant's shot is off. Batum, pass to Westbrook. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Watanabe's got rebound number five here tonight. Hayden finds Booker. And Kawhi Leonard gets the whistle that time. That's his third foul of the game. First team foul. And here are the Suns now. They've led by as many as 14. Durant, the pass to Watanabe. You can see how Batum uses both size and positioning to guard. What a contest. What a job making that difficult. Westbrook with it. Beal picks him up. George's shot is off. For Phoenix, they've gone just one of three in the second half. Pass to Watanabe. Screen by Durant. And here's Aiden. Now Booker. An important role in this offense. Averaging around 12 and a half per game. Aiden, no good. And I'm sure this isn't how they drew it up at the half. Only one for five here in the third quarter. Here's Westbrook. And the Clippers miss again. Well, an 0-3 start to the half. You need to pick it up and start to put some pressure on your opponent. Beal goes in. Pass to Aiden. Here's Booker. Durant for three. Yes! And it's Booker with the setup. Booker's got six assists now in the game. 
into the third. Two minutes in now. Westbrook against Beal. On the take. Oh, rejected by Ayton. Outstanding shot blocker. DeAndre Ayton off his feet in a hurry to send it back. With the floater. Durant, the pass to Ayton. Here's Watanabe. Hands it with nobody near him. And it's an eight-point Suns lead. And they've committed to controlling the boards and it's paying dividends. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Just about halfway through the season. Let's take a look at how things stand in the West. You look at the Suns. They're in first place right now with a tremendous record. They're certainly the team to beat. And, of course, the Clippers. They're six overall in the conference. When I look at the Clippers, you have to acknowledge that they've really hung tough this season, avoiding a lot of the bumps in the road that other contenders have gone through. The resiliency has been crucial for this team. Anytime it looks like they may start to drag a little bit, they picked it back up and stayed in the hunt. It's Beal on the wing, pounded by Westbrook. Durant with a screen on Batum. Watanabe passes to Aiden. Durant with a screen on George. Five to shoot. Booker. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It's going to go on Kawhi Leonard. Well, the strong drive by D. Book just forces the defender's hand right there. You give this guy an opening and he will attack it. That free throw good from Booker. Powell, he's checked in for Kawhi Leonard. Free throws good from Booker. You love that Devin Booker now has experienced postseason success because there were some who questioned his greatness. Now that conversation is over. Now here's Westbrook. He's got 13. Pulls up on the wing. George, no good. Phoenix has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. Inside. Oh, and the jam by Aiton. You have to be accurate there. Very little room for error passing on the interior. For three, George. The Suns clear it. Durant's got rebound number 12 here already in the game. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Durant with a screen on Westbrook. Goes up at the elbow. And it's Phoenix with another. Now this is an example of where he's grown. Bradley Beal getting it done in the screen and roll. Batum outside. Pass to Westbrook. And Aiden pulls it down. Aiden's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. It's been an ugly quarter for him. Trying to shoot his way out of it. Might be time to work on the playmaking skills. Now here's Booker. He's got six. The shot won't fall. Batum with the defensive effort. And it's Powell with the ball for Los Angeles. A 12-point game. To the middle. Here's Zubac. And it's slammed in by Zubac. Wow, pretty pass from Powell. This guy has great instincts as a scorer. At that time, sets up his teammate. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Well, some have called Kawhi Leonard a cyborg, but he said, quote, a coach can't put a battery in your back and tell you to play harder to go win games. You have to have the mindset, and you have to train your body to reach the level that you want to play at. Guys? No doubt. He is always locked in. Thanks, Allie. Westbrook against Beal. Zubats with a screen on Beal. Down low. Kicks it to George. Back to Zubats. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. All right, Grant, talking about Ivica Zubats, what do you like most about his game? Well, just his defensive presence. I mean, he's willing to challenge shots at the rim, refusing to give anything easy. He misses the free throw. It's been great watching Ivica Zubats' growth. This guy, his game has evolved, and his role is increasing. Martin, he's checked in for the Clippers.
Good on the second one. Phoenix calls timeout. Let's see some of the numbers here for Devin Booker. He's been really dialed in from deep during these last five games. Looking assertive and in control every time he rises up to shoot from beyond the three-point line. And it's been fun to watch. The Suns have gone 5 of 11 in this third quarter. Aiton, a screen on George. Here's Booker. Let's it go from the baseline and nails it. Booker's got four points now in the quarter. This is one of the specialties of Devin Booker. That mid-range, you offer it, he'll take it. Powell finds Zubats. Powell sets a screen. The steal. Here's the break. Aiden, the screen on Powell. Radonami passes to Aiden. Great D that time from Zubats. Oh. All right, guys, what do you think so far on the offensive approach for the Suns? I mean, they've played some beautiful basketball all game. The passing has been impressive, and it's opened up things with their ball movement. Also, they've been living in the lane. They're getting the ball in close, and it's had a devastating impact all game long. They're doing what they can do to mount a comeback. In B.A., they don't have to get it all back at once. Just focus on making every possession count. Now here's Zubats. Five points in the game. Westbrook against Beal. Four on the clock. 18 feet out. And Aiden pulls it down. Aiden's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. I'll tell you, it's been a struggle for him in this period, and they're struggling as a result. Here's Durant. He's got 25. Watanabe sets a screen. Durant finds Aiden. Now here's Beal. To the paint. With the teardrop. And the shot clock expires. 24-second violation. The Suns making a switch here. Gordon's checked in. They're looking to trim the deficit to single digits. Powell for three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. They've led by as many as 14. Here's Booker. Ooh, against inside resistance. Booker still good. Well, you love the lethal scoring ability off the dribble. Booker putting extraordinary pressure on the defense. George's shot is good. His first triple of the second half. That makes three for the game. Durant, pass to Aiden. It's rebounded by Zubats. Los Angeles has gone only one of three from deep here in the third. Martin with the ball. Now guarded by Aiden. Pass to Powell. And here's George. Elbow shot. And he knocks the jumper down. George has got 19 points. Are you kidding me? Just look at what Paul George is doing to the defense over and over. My goodness. Booker, good. Well, easy money, right? I like the strategy. Go inside, get a high percentage look. Now Zubats. Back to Westbrook. Zubats with a screen on Beal. Westbrook can't hit. Well, two long-range bombs in the first, but that's stalled out right now. Durant, the pass to Gordon. Outside Booker. Durant with a screen on George. Back to Durant. And Durant with the big finish. What you love about this young guard, Devin Booker, is his ability to hurt you with both his passing and his shooting. The Clippers shooting a low 29% since halftime. Westbrook, the pass to Zubats. And it's slammed in by Zubats. Oh, yeah. That'll do it. Wow, an emphatic two-handed slam. Thank you, Russell Westbrook. The Suns leading. Booker with it. 12 points for him. 
eight on the screen on Westbrook. Here's Beal. And it's Phoenix with another. Well, Bradley Beal gets into the mid-range. Let's remember, this is a three-level score. He will take what you give him. Westbrook, the pass to Zubac. Here's Westbrook. Over Beal. Westbrook can't hit. Not his best night, and not the team's best night. Sometimes it just goes that way. Back to Gordon. Pass to Beal. Durant with a screen on Westbrook. Here's Beal. And the Suns getting another bucket right there. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Now here's Westbrook. He's got 13. George's shot is off. Booker against George. Booker, the pass to Aiden. And Aiden with the stuff. And that's a double-double for him now. How about the vision from Devin Booker? Yes, he can score it, but that's a pretty pass. They double-team George. For three, Westbrook nails it from beyond the arc. Westbrook's got four points now in the quarter. This has been an awful quarter for him. Just one for eight. Pass to Beal. Aiden with a screen. Durant, the pass to Aiden. And out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. And we always like to take this chance to show you the scoring leaders from the last 10 days of action. Second is Kevin Durant. He's been on an absolute tear offensively. He's found something that's working for him, and he's sticking to it. Gordon against Powell. Pass to Westbrook. Oh, from deep. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Hayton's got rebound number 13 for him here tonight. Gordon, the pass to Aiden. Oh, and the jam by Aiden. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. A minute four left in the third quarter. Zubox with a screen on Booker. Now Westbrook, pounded by Beal. Westbrook against Beal. Clock at six. Martin outside. Three-pointer. That's good. And so Westbrook with the assist. Westbrook's got six assists here tonight. And Aiden has got the ball here for Phoenix. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Aiden, the screen on Westbrook. Beal, the pass to Aiden. Gordon outside. Duran with a screen on Powell. Back to Duran. It's hauled in by the Clippers. Now here's Martin. Give him eight. Westbrook outside. And George launches it from deep. Duran pulls it in. Duran's got 15 rebounds here tonight. To the inside. That's good from Aiden. On the assist by Booker. Aiden's got eight here in this quarter. This guy has got a dominant physical frame, incredible athleticism. Nice job by DeAndre Aiden inside. And so it's Phoenix in a good situation, up by 13 points to close the quarter. They just can't miss right now. Every shot they're taking, you assume, is going in. And more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way right after this. All right, let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. And <laughs> just a selfless decision from your two guard, showing his ability to get his teammates good looks. How about the secondary playmaking you are getting? Great to have that from the shooting guard spot. It's not over yet, and with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. They've got Kenyon Martin. Terrence Mann is out there with Paul George. Then it's Robert Covington, and it's Plumley in at the center position. That's who's out there for the Clippers. Here's Goodwin. Pass to Watanabe. There's a screen by Bolt. 
Baranami passes to Bowl and finished off by Bowl. That pass was about the location. Puts it perfectly into the hands of his teammate. And for the Clippers, they're shooting the ball at around 42% for the game. Now here's George. Outside Covington. George left side. With a step back. That one rolls around and rims out. Oh, man, he can't get anything to fall. You can feel his frustration. He is trying to shoot his way out of it, and it might be better for him to pass the basketball at this point. A quick shot there. It's off target. After the strong first half, this guy has not been the same, and largely a no-show right here. Okogi shot is off. For Los Angeles, they've gone 0 for 3 in this fourth. Not good. George passes to Covington. It's hauled in by the Suns. Booker with it. Martin picks him up. There's the triple. Nice shot by Okogi. Shooting with range is almost something you must possess in the modern NBA. Josh Okogi with the deep delivery. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Martin, the pass to Plumley. Slam dunk by Plumley. Coach is loving the ball movement. Phoenix has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. We're about two minutes into the fourth here. Watanabe sets a screen. Booker, the pass to Goodwin. Off target from outside. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. George outside. Let's it go from deep. Bowl grabs the board. Bowl's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Booker goes in. Pass to Goodwin. And here's Bowl down low. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three second call. So for the Clippers, Powell, he's checked in for Martin. And it's Russell Westbrook in for man. Norman Powell. The Clippers have got one out of six shots to fall in this final quarter. Not ideal. Here's Westbrook. Lays it up and banks it in. Well, great work from Russell Westbrook. The closer he is, the more aggressive he becomes. Pass to Watanabe. Now here's Booker. Shoots over George. And the call over the back. Just a little too eager for that rebound. As a result, gets called for the over the back. And to me, that's just a case of being too aggressive. You're out of position. Don't compound the problem by committing that foul. Westbrook, the pass to George. Shoots over Booker. Again, the Clippers score. We call that money from the mid-range. PG doing his thing in the sweet spot. Pass to Okogi. Now here's Bold. He's checked by Plumley. Bold. Pass to Goodwin. And here's Booker. Rebounded by Russell Westbrook. The Clippers have gotten three of eight shot attempts to find the net here in the fourth quarter. Covington. Yes. And it's George picking up the assist. George has got three assists now in this one. Really good job by Covington to get good position and finish. DeAndre Eaton, he's checked in for the Suns. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Alley. During that break, Coach Frank Vogel had some advice for his team. He kept it real with his team, telling them, I know you feel good about this lead, but let's not get lazy. Let's not act like this is a sure thing all of a sudden. Looking to keep their focus on the task at hand. Brian? Great work, Alley. Thanks. A nice shot by Booker. You know, put a rough first half behind him. He's absolutely crushing it here in the second. Pass to George. Westbrook outside. Hey, puts up a three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Aiton's Phoenix has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. Here's Okogi. Aiton inside. George defending. Here's Watanabe. Inside. Booker for three. 
Westbrook with the rebound. Westbrook's got four rebounds now. Pass to George. From the high post. And again, it's the Clippers. Well, just pretty form, right? Paul George effortless as a scorer. Goodwin passes to Booker. Here's the teardrop. Oh, you can't let Booker get that close. I'll tell you, you have got to have a short memory. You put a poor first half behind you, and you get to work here in the second. Booker against George. Kicks it out to Westbrook. Pass to Plumley, And that one comes off the assist by Westbrook. Westbrook's got assist number seven tonight. Credit the hard work coming back. They're doing their best to steal this game. <laughs> Showing so much passion and determination here at the end. They're close to the lead, but still have plenty of work left to do. They get the rebound. And Aiton with the stuff. This guy a relentless force on the glass. DeAndre Aiton going to work and getting the putback. The Clippers have gotten 6 of 12 shots to go here in this fourth quarter. Covington, a screen on Booker. George for three. Drops in the three. George has got 26 points. You simply must play better defense than that. This guy is too good from distance. The Suns have got five out of ten shots to drop here in the final quarter. Goodwin passes to Booker. Here's Goodwin. Here's Watanabe. Eight, a screen on Covington. Pass to Goodwin. Five on the clock. Here's a Kogi. Trying to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. I'll tell you, he's trying to help them extend this lead, but it's been a tough night for him individually. George passes to Plumley. Kicks it to George. Launches it. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Hayden's got his 16th rebound on the night. Okoki, the pass to Aiden. Aiden with a screen. Pass to Goodwin. Okogi on the wing. Here's Watanabe. The teardrop. Not going to go that time. Good D by Covington. And it's the Clippers on the break. For three, Westbrook. It's hauled in by the Suns. They led by as many as 18. Aiden passes to Watanabe. Booker with it. Let's it go from 14. That one goes in. Booker's got 14 points now in the second half. You know, I thought in the first half this guy was pressing. He was rushing. Now he's settled into the game. Westbrook with the miss. Boy, that's too easy to miss, but somehow he finds a way to do it. Okogi, the pass to Watanabe. Here's Goodwin, pounded by Westbrook. And that one is stuffed right through. Boy, doesn't get any easier than that. What a size advantage and just goes to work. And here's George. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. Trailing by 13. Shoots over Booker. George, no good. And this is exactly what you have to do to stop him. That was a tremendous contest, forcing the miss. Pass to Aiden. Here's Watanabe. Outside Booker. Watanabe sets a screen. Booker, the pass to Goodwin. Back to Booker. Here's a Kogi. Three-pointer off the mark. Well, they needed that ball. They've had a hard time on the glass, but they still have a shot here. Westbrook left side. Up again. That one no good. This guy has not been a factor at all in this quarter, and it has hurt the team. Okogi, the pass to Aiden. Oh, George with a steal. And it's the Clippers on the break. 
for three. Covington. Yes, and it's George picking up the assist. They are unconscious from outside, and so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. Timeout called. The Suns and a new group getting ready for the Clippers. Zubats, he's checked in for Plumley. Batum comes in for Covington. Kawhi Leonard's checked in for Powell. And it's Mann in for Russell Westbrook. Kevin Durant, he's checked in for the Suns. Beal comes in for Goodwin. Pass to Watanabe. Outside Booker. Over George. That one a little long. Los Angeles shooting just 38% here in the fourth. Here's Mann. Fires from deep. And the Clippers hit again from deep. Here's Beal. Now here's Aiden. It's Booker on the wing. Aiden, a screen on George. From the strike. Booker's shot is good. Booker's got eight points here in the quarter. A quality decision making off that pick and roll. Booker just taking what the defense gives him. George against Booker from the right block. Nifty move. George's shot is off. The Suns leading. Outside for Booker. Durant for three. Oh, Durant. An absolute sniper. One of the tough things about Kevin Durant, doesn't matter if it's off the dribble or in this situation off the catch, Durant one of the best, period. Here's George, and the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. First team. At the line for your players, Paul George. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. off on the second. You know, he doesn't shrink the lead as much as he should have. That hurts a bit. Here's Watanabe. George defending. Hooker surveying the floor. Back to Durant. And Durant with the big finish. Devin Hooker. Here's George. We've got 113 left to play in the fourth quarter. This one for three. And Aiden pulls it down. When you're not in rhythm with the three ball, why do you keep firing from there? Well, with a comeback out of range, we can put a bow on this one. Good performance for the Suns. They were the more accurate club. And in the end, that made the difference, Grant. Yeah, B.A., you have to love their strategy. And even more, you love the execution. And they increase their win total to 29. And with the win, the season series is tied one-to-one. -one. You have to love how competitive these games have been with two more left to play. And as it was happening, as it was building, you knew this was a monster game for Kevin Durant. They simply can't stop him right now. This guy playing with passion and focus. Here's Booker. The Clippers getting their last shot to go. Takes it inside. Yeah, Devin Booker, shiftiness, gets himself into the paint. So aggressive, and it pays off. First team foul. Shooting for Phoenix, Devin Booker. That free throw good from Booker. Free throws good from Booker. Here are the Clippers. 15-point game. Here's Boston. To the middle. Here's Martin. And it's flushed down. A nice jam. And a solid pick to free him up for the dunk. Boy, the timing there couldn't be any better. But the execution was simply flawless. That, ladies and gentlemen, is how you run that play.
Puts it up from the high post. Ooh, he buries it. And just totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. So it's the Suns winning this one easily. Exceptional effort on the road. They were ready and they were focused. Focused indeed. I mean, it takes a strong mental approach to block out the distractions. These guys stepped up 100%. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Ali LaForce, Grant Hill, and Doris Burke, I'm Brian Anderson saying thanks for tuning in. And as we leave, we give you our New Balance Player of the Game, Kevin Durant.